My name is Tanner Wilson. I got invited by Joseph Zimmerman to uh, do a solo show here, and I was born here, so that was a pretty important thing to me. It's my hometown. I was uh, kind of jumping at the opportunity to uh, show a bunch of new work here, and this is my first solo show. I was like, why the hell not, you know? <laughs> A lot of it is me stripping down what I used to do, not really knowing what it was gonna be until the until the end of it. I would start a piece and I wouldn't really know what it was until the very end. And then it would kinda hit me in a certain way, but it wasn't like I used to paint, which is how I used to paint was like, okay, this painting has to be perfect. It needs to mean this, this, and this before I even paint it. And now it was me vomiting these things out of my subconscious that I would just kinda pair them together and there were words triggering me, and there were sentences that would trigger me, and there was imagery that would trigger me, and then I would kind of mash it all together. And I was kind of hesitant on telling people what it really meant. You know, what it hits for them was a little more important to me. I don't really know what it means, and maybe it means more to me than I think. I started liking the way they made me feel. I started enjoying painting again, which was a really important thing for me, because at first it was, I was painting because it was like, that's what I needed to do, you know, and now I was painting for me and I was painting stuff that I wanted to do and I didn't really want to put a big overall meaning on it all, you know, I wanted to just be like, okay, well, this is what it is. If you find something else, something different in it than I do, then props to you. I, I'm not a religious person. I'm actually not a spiritual person either. I'm definitely into iconography. I'm into the the theology aspect of it. I'm into the, the how permanent it is, like burning in hell or raining in heaven. But it's something I think that hits hits like a, a a center point in people. But I think some people when they see it and they see a cross, for example, they think a certain way. You know, you have logical people living in a world who still take something that is super illogical and super not based on factual evidence, but they take it super serious. I mean, they take it to the point where they will die for it. In art, it's me trying to draw a little reaction out of people. So I started painting differently. I started pulling a lot of inspiration from the way I write graffiti. Not caring as much, I guess, simply about what they look like and um, it was, it kind of opened up the door for me to be more experimental and just uh, put colors in, which I never did, and I had a lot of fun with it. Having fun with painting and enjoying um, putting a little more livelihood into it or, uh, you know, not trying to just stick to a certain theme that I thought was like the way I should do things. So I might as well, you know.